not a game, it's a red stick. Hello there, Foreign Beauty. It's your girl, Eunice Marie here. And so today, we are going to be doing a full demo and review of the Derma E Overnight Pill. Now, I have been using the Overnight Pill. I've used it twice already, and I really, really enjoyed it. So I wanted to do a review on it and um, show you guys how I use it and, you know, my thoughts and, you know, how I feel about it. So... First of all, um, my face, I did cleanse it. I did um, do a face mask and all of that because you want to cleanse your face, of course, before using this product. So this is the Derma E Overnight Peel with the Alpha Hydroxy AHAs. This skin brightening non-abrasive blend of alpha hydroxy acids exfoliate overnight to help visibly smooth skin, giving you a healthy, youthful and glowing appearance. Um, so when I first saw this, usually with me, whenever... I hear like pill or pill in general it makes me a little uneasy of course there are levels when it comes to pills chemical pills any type of acid there are levels to it there are some that are very gentle that are just you know lightweight and there are some that are more abrasive but for me it's always like uh, you know how is this going to work for me so pretty much you guys know I trust Derma E um, I use plenty of products by Derma E I love their products that I stand by them 110%, okay? Um, so how you would use is that you would apply a, you apply generously to clean face before bed, leave on overnight, and rest thoroughly in the morning. Use one to two times a week. I personally have not used this once or twice a week. I use this probably once out the month, and that's because I do use a glycolic face wash every now and then. So I don't want to use too many acids in my regimen. So let's go ahead and let's apply this. This is a two fluid ounce and of course all info on this will be down below in the description box. It comes with a pump like so and this really shocked me when I first used it because let me pump. I'm going to use two pumps because they say a generous amount and this really shocked me because it feels a lot like a moisturizer. So what I do is I just go ahead and I generously apply it to my face I avoid the eye area and I really saturate my cheeks and my forehead it is so lightweight it's literally a moisturizer like it feels like a moisturizer um, and that's one of the things that shocked me when I first used it and I do take it down my neck um, but it is a very lightweight it just feels like a lightweight moisturizer going on it's not heavy um, you do feel a little bit of a tingle, of course, when it comes to that um, AHAs, but two pumps for me, that's it. I put it right along my cheek area, lip, nose, forehead, down the neck, and it seeps right into the skin. And look, it's just like a moisturizer. It doesn't make my skin feel like sticky. It doesn't make my skin feel heavy. My skin is not irritated. And it's just like a lightweight moisturizer you put on before you go to bed. And that is it. So you put this on. I let it set overnight. And then I get up in the morning. I rinse it off. And I go on about my skincare regimen. So that is pretty much what I'm going to do. And I will be back in the morning time to rinse my face. And to just show you guys what my skin looks like after that. But it's just that simple. You throw it on. And um, you let it work overnight. So I really do like this. I have been using it for some time. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to let this seep, seep on my skin overnight. It's not greasy. It's none of that. It's okay to sleep on your pillow with this. It doesn't, it just seeps right into the skin like a regular moisturizer, okay? So I will see you guys in the morning. Okay, good morning, Informed Beauties. Your girl Eunice here, and it is the next day. So, of course, I slept with the overnight mask or overnight pill on. Um, if I do look a little oily or sweaty, it's because I just finished working out, and I totally wanted to do this. I for totally forgot to like. I wanted to film it for you guys, me rinsing off my face. I didn't want to just go into like having it already rinsed off. Um, but yeah, so I put this on about I don't know what time was it yesterday, eight o'clock or so. And, um, yeah, I put it on about 8 o'clock last night, and so I had it on ever since then, and I, you know, slept and all that. So this is what my face looks like, and I have been sweating, so it may be like a little 
whatever and I probably sweated it all off by now you know whatever but um, so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to rinse my face <laughs> Okay, so usually what I do, um, let me see what the instructions say to do. I know with me, I usually rinse my face and then I go in and I will cleanse my face with my cleanser. But pretty much this just says leave on overnight and rinse thoroughly in the morning time. So you want to make sure you rinse it off. So I probably should have rinsed it off before I worked out, but I just got into it. So we didn't waste no time this morning. Um, but I probably would suggest rinsing it off before you work out, okay? So, I rinsed it off my face. My face feels amazing, but I don't stop here, of course. I do go in with my, um, cleanser, my moisturizer, and all of that. So, I'm gonna jump in the shower really quickly and get myself together, and then we'll come back and we'll talk more about this product. So, I'll be right back. Alright, you guys. So, I, I am back. Alright, so I just went ahead and I'll cleanse my face with my NOLA Skin Essentials uh, Clarifying Cleanser and then I tone with my Dickasins and then I put on some Shea Moisture Moisturizer and this is what my face looks like. My face is really smooth, it's really soft to touch. As you guys can see, we do have lovely breakouts and some little things going on there. Um, but overall, like my skin, it feels smooth and I can tell that it did do a good job at um doing that light exfoliation and i like having that light exfoliation i have like a nasty blackhead i don't know if you guys can see it right here i'm gonna have to extract that bad boy if you guys want to see a tutorial on that let me know but i'm gonna have to extract that because mm -mm. that is not it but um so overall, I really do like the Derma E Essentials Overnight AHA Pill. It's very gentle. It's not abrasive at all. I really do think this is a great start off pill. So if you're looking for something to help out with dark spots or just to give your skin a light exfoliation and to resurface the skin, I really do... Um, I really do think Derma E's Overnight Pill is a great way to start off. You throw it on your face at night. It's a lightweight. It feels like a moisturizer. It doesn't dry you out. It doesn't irritate you. None of that, at least with my skin. And then you rinse it off in the morning, go about your day, and you have a nice, smooth, um, great canvas to start off with. So definitely, definitely, I suggest this. I also say make sure you're moisturizing after in the morning, the next morning. Make sure you throw some moisturizer on that skin. But all in all, you guys, I love this product. Um, I will utilize it in my skincare about probably once out the month or so because like I said, I do use the glycolic acid, um, the glycolic uh, facial wash from Mila Skin Essential. I use that like twice out the week or so. So I don't want to overdo it with any AHAs or any pills or any exfoliants. Um, so it's very important that you kind of like balance out what's already in your skincare regimen. This is great for me to throw in like once a month for like a nice little overnight like peel just to get my skin to resurface if I feel like it's needed. But all information to this will be down below in the description box. If you have tried this product, let me know down below. And with that being said, you guys, make sure to rate, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And I will see you in a later video. Bye.